that's not roasting. Jack Frost nipping at your nose. Hello, everyone. I am about to do a review on the wig grip that I purchased about a week ago and show y'all how well it works. Like, I love it. It's awesome. That's how I can wear a wig now to work because I'm not really a big wig person. But recently, as you've seen on my other video, I experimented and made my own wig. But it was loose and I only would wear it on the weekend. So I was like, I wanna wear this like to work start wearing my own wigs to work the wigs that i plan on making for the future but there's no way i could wear them loose like this what could i do like i don't know i can't use bobby pins like i i just don't me and bobby pins don't work well together i don't know i don't use them correctly i don't know and i didn't want to really try to put combs it was an idea if i hadn't found this wig grip but i was thinking maybe putting combs in the wig looking up how to do that because that was my next option but I really didn't want to comb either because sometimes like combs you know I, I wear drawstring little ponytails and the combs like leave an indent in your head after all day and this starts giving you a headache and I'm like I really didn't want that either so I came across this wig grip and I was like what let me try it and a lot of people was like hey those things don't work but I think it's the brand that you have to get, which I'll show y'all later. All right, so I'm finna, I've been wearing my wig all week, y'all. And underneath here <laughs> is some French braids that is not braids anymore. It's like all frizzed up and bad, okay? Cause see, I got halfway French braid, like I got French braid good enough to put a wig on or, you know, good enough to do a little stretch out, but I don't really French braid good at all it's good enough for me you know what i'm saying so if i could really french braid these braids would still be braided back and looking good but since i can't it's like french braid with a little fro growing out around the french braids that's left so what i'm gonna do is take this down moisturize it with some stuff and braid it on back and then i will show y'all the wig grip and how it works, okay? Mm. Mm. I know, y'all see my arms in this shape. <laughs> oh my gosh, y'all look at this. What is this? Like, no, we're gonna take this down. I know what this is. What is this? This is the container it comes in. It's a glare. But the brand is GEX Worldwide Wig Grip. So it has to be the GEX Worldwide Wig Grip. Because I read reviews on other wig grips, and I guess they were putting it all, all the wig grips in one category no matter the brand and a lot of people were like that this wig grip don't work and and so but when i read the reviews on this one positive everybody was happy and i was like let me get that one and test it out i don't know it might be bad like the other ones i'ma see well 
I have not tested other ones, but I know this one is good and I'm sticking with this one. So G-E-X Worldwide Wig Grip, okay? Their website is www.gexworldwide.com, okay? And here, this is how it goes on your head. Sorry, y'all, such a glare. I'm using this natural light. And they come in different colors, as you can see right here. Different colors right there. And I got like the dark brown. So let me show you. This is it. Okay, I got like the chocolate one. And here's the label right here. And it tells you on the label. Wear with the label facing outward on the right side of your head. Okay? And it says, as shown on the picture. And it's, it's washable, so wash it in cold water. Okay? There we go. And I have this, y'all. It came, like, last Saturday, I think, like a week ago. And I ordered it, and it came within, like, four days. It was supposed to come, like... The day after Christmas, it came way early. Shocked. It was the holidays and everything. I ordered it on Amazon for $11.99. Free shipping. And it was $11.99. So this is it, y'all. Right here. And it's like a velvet. It's velvet. And it has a little strap in the back. It's like this. You can adjust it. Stretch. It's flexible. And just put it on the little snap. So, let me show y'all my wig without that and see how easy it is to come off. Like, it was just, I didn't feel safe wearing it. I just felt like if somebody gave me a hug at work, they might pull it half off or something. Like, no, we don't got time for that. But with this, I felt comfortable. Like, I even feel comfortable pulling it back and a little pointer. Then I didn't want to pull it back. I was all gentle with it, and it wasn't a tight ponytail. Like, but let me show y'all. So, here's my wig. Here's Veronica. This hair is Veronica. The dummy, she's Bella. At least today. That name might change, but this is Bella. But here's my wig that I made, y'all. Okay. Now let's test it without the wig grip and see how loose it is. Okay, so here it is without the wig grip this is it still looks good and everything you know but it's so easy look so easy I just easily pulled it from the back y'all saw how easy that was I just mm, pulled it so somebody give me a hug to not even hard but just kind of snug on the hair it'll come half off like I could not wear it to work. It had to be a weekend thing. If I was just going to chill with a friend, going out to eat, can't wear it to work. You know what I'm saying? And then my old job, show couldn't wear it because people at that job, the guys play too much. They were always pulling my hair. Couldn't wear a wig. No, no. So anyways, let's put the wig grip and see the difference. So, put the wig to the side. Where the wig grip go, y'all? Here it is. So here it is. Here's the label. They said to put it the right side of your head. Wear with the label facing outward and to the right side of your head. So here it is, outward. Okay? You don't want it to be inward. You want it to be outward. 
and facing to the right side of your head. So, here we go. Here. You can tighten it, tighten it to fit your head. Okay? Put it like that. You can move it up from them edges. So the edges won't get messed up. What is this? Some glue from my wig. But yeah. There it is, y'all. The label outward to the right side of your head. Okay? There we go. You just put it around. Here's the back. So that is the label I work right side of the head. Velvet. This is it. Leave some of them edges out. Okay. We don't want to smother the edges. Now, let's put Veronica back on. Gotta get it right, y'all. So here is the wig on with the wig grip. Okay. And let's pull. See? She ain't coming down. The other one, y'all saw how easy it just came off. This one, see, it can move a little. But it ain't coming off. See that? Yeah. It works, y'all. It works great. I love it. So, get it wind up right. Even trying to adjust it, you can feel the grip. When the other one slides very easy. So I just feel comfortable wearing this. The other one slides right off. This one won't. So it works well, y'all. I love it. And I will buy more. They got a customer. They got a customer here. Now the other ones, I can't say if they work or not. I read bad reviews. But this one, nothing but good reviews, which I posted a good one the other day. And as you see, I'm making this video telling y'all how good it is. Like, get this wig grip. It works wonders. I love it. Now I'm going to be a big wig fanatic, okay? I'm going to be making wigs and it's going to be great. So, yeah, it works, y'all. Works good. It's the back of it. G-E-X Worldwide. Okay? Go with them. They work great. I love them. And I'm not getting paid for this. They have no idea I'm doing this. I'm just a happy customer. <laughs> happy customer, and I want to let everyone else know this is good product. And to use it like I'm so happy with it I feel comfortable with it so yeah I can pull it on back 
The other one's so loose, I didn't want to pull it back. Look, I feel comfortable pulling it back. I even took a nap with this on, on Christmas Day. Woke up, still on my head, still safe. Not moved back, still normal. I was like, what? So yeah, y'all, this is a good brand, G-E-X. Uh, it's G-E-X Beauty Flexible Velvet. Um, with grip. So, that's it, y'all. That is the wig grip. It's what's up. And here, take it on off. Take my wig off. Here's the band. Right there. Like so. Okay. And just take it on off. Voila! yeah so make sure this is facing outward to the right of your head otherwise it may not hold right okay i haven't tried it any other way so i'm sure the wig won't hold right because i other reviews people were saying maybe it don't work for certain people because they don't have it on right it's a certain way because the velvet like you what you move it a certain way and you can feel the rough side to where that's what keeps the wig in place. The other way, you wear it backwards, it's just smooth. So the wig could just slide. So you gotta have it right. All right, and that's it. So this is the wrong way with no tag. This way is the right way, but to the right of your head, not the left, to this side. Like that. All right, y'all, so that's it. Hi y'all, thank y'all for watching and I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Stay tuned for many more. Alright, holla, your girl Christy. Bye y'all.